love is blind. So you'd literally be doing this. <laughs> but instead of being a friend, you'd be meeting your husband. Yeah, that'd be terrifying. Hey, Kendall, do you want to do it? <laughs> I think that's what she said. Oh, I see her. I see her. <laughs> Oh you can have whatever you want. You can have whatever you want. Can I take it the back of your neck and then you're gonna laugh? Yay! Good girl. Good girl. You are so smart. Smart. We need the smartest ever. But we just need she her not to your learn to walk. Oh, she wants God. her to drag me. Uh oh. Okay. You. <laughs> Oh, oh my gosh, she's uh -oh. letting me hold her. Wait, wait, where'd a dragon go? Let's wake up. What are you doing? Can I have it? Wait, so good job. Oh, she was doing this. Stop. Well, it's 
you want I picked the right it? thing. Here you go. There you go. <laughs> yeah, two hands, bro. Two hands. Yeah. Good job. Yay. What is it? I'll put it asleep. <laughs> <laughs> Do you love it? Yeah. It's a dino. Ooh, still pretty. And then this is your cake smash outfit. Put it. Look. Look. Ooh. Pretty. I'm just gonna try to put this bow. Put it on as a hat. Oh. Oh, oh my, my gosh. <laughs> Hi. It's so good. Yep. Yep. Oh. For two seconds. Okay. And we're done. <laughs> I'll do. I'll do the other outfit at some point too. Look at you. Look at you! Oh gosh, she looks precious. Where are we going, everybody? Barn. Barn. Woo -woo. I just call it Barnes. 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 I just call it Barnes. We're on like We're going one first Barnes. name of Doug's terms. <laughs> Who do you think is going to walk out with the most? <laughs> um, well, we're only on the first aisle, and Liv has four hardcovers already. I only have two. My bet's still on Kindle, though. Yeah, always Kindle for sure. Guys, who do you think is going to come out with the most? Me? <laughs> for sure, Kindle. Or me. It's me or her. Her or me. She's got more books than hers than me so far. Yeah, she's at this first aisle, and she only has four. <laughs> yeah, yeah. No, I, I have three. Starting with four, so. Okay, I have three. Uh, but this is like, you go through once, and, and then, then you, you edit. eliminate. You edit. Then you edit. <laughs> you edit. <laughs> you edit the card. Kendall's counting already. <laughs> Your face. Okay. Okay. Um, well, if you want a Bernie Sanders <laughs> mystery. Would y'all like this to be the next Cozy, Cozy Hollow pick? Because I personally think it's the, the burn. Best. Why are there droids up there? Not droids, Jones. Oh, but there's a little black cat. Oh I do think that cover is cute. He's got his gloves. That's the He's picture. Got his <laughs> That's the picture of him when he was at the, um, the little inauguration. Yeah, he he was like doing that. that. Look at the back of the bus. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Look how pretty. I really want this one. 
I'm just that holding them and we'll see if I buy them. The undersea horror okay. that Kendall got on her. Did she finish that? Did, Did you read it, it all? No. I but I haven't even it. tried this author, but Jillian Flynn says it's astoundingly great. MTV Entertainment Books. This Come could in. be our book we get together. I'm so picky with horror, though. I How many stack. do we have in total? My need stack is really <laughs> high. <laughs> This is like, I need to the get them. The neat stack. Yeah. Oh my gosh, I haven't pulled out the other Guys, mine's yet. pathetic. Oh, she's got more. <laughs> I haven't even pulled the, and I have to get this one. <laughs> what is oh happening? Oh my gosh. I'm going to have to, oh, no. Decide. Hello. <laughs> I'm obsessed. Cute. You could. How much cheaper? I always like to check and see. Oh, I only have four. I only have five. You only have four? Yeah. Okay, so whisper it to us. Oh my gosh. Boy, oh, like America is struggling. We're in a state nature and a vampire. I'm attracted. Better than mine. <laughs> You're so good at it. I have a sixth hat with a ghost of this age. What am I so constipated? Oh. Okay, all right. I can't do it when, when I'm whispering. I need to be loud. With the soul. With the soul. With the soul. And dip. Yeah. Whoops. Exhibit. Dip. 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 Wow. Perfection. <laughs> Yes to the Grady Hendrix. I know, and I want to read this one because Elizabeth loved it. Yeah. You didn't like this one? I haven't read Book of Cold Cases. I'll read it with you though. Okay. Because I have it. Okay, so we're getting both of these. There we go. Yeah. So if I, I mean, I don't want to check in a second bag, but if I have to, it's not the worst. Hey, Willa. Hi. Hi. This is me, and this is Rachel. <laughs> <laughs> Self-control. Uh -huh. Look at the fall vibes we have going on. All yeah, we fall. got some yeah. great fall books. I mean, all of these, pretty much. Yeah, we gotta get all the stickers off. I yeah, know. the so, booba That's the next step. I forgot you got this one. Yeah, mm -hmm. so cute. I love this cover. Yeah. Did you get this from Barnes? Yeah, it's in Chicago, so I kind of had to get it. Ooh. Let's look at Powell's, and I might grab that one if I see it. Look at Elizabeth perfecting those stacks. Well, yeah, I gotta keep up with you guys. <laughs> <laughs> Immediately, the ones were just like equal stacks. Make yeah. sure it's perfect. <laughs> Mine's Jenga over here. <laughs> it's sticking out. Oh. Ouch. Wait, Kendall. What? Huh? Where's your Olivia Blake? At the bottom. Oh, you can't see it. Yeah. Oh, holy moly. Holy moly. Oh, look at them beautiful stacks. They're all kind of dark. Yeah. yeah it's because we're dark inside. I see it in your eyes. Yeah. 
Twilight was filmed. Oh my gosh. Are you excited? Are you excited? <laughs> <laughs> uh, let all the Twilight reels ensue. Oh, I found it. I found it. <laughs> Super massive black hole. <laughs> it's the Twilight dance party, y'all. Regular speed. <laughs> like four times. What if I walk? Okay. Well, it's walk. like running. Yeah, walk. Walk. Do a fast walk, <laughs> and then and then we'll use Elizabeth's cam we'll use okay. Elizabeth's camera. Yes. At four times speed in the reel, okay. and it'll speed you up four times. Okay. Fast. Let's practice. You Are you close enough? Can you see all that? Get it? <laughs> oh, you really should have said that. 
<laughs> no. Okay, we gotta go back. It's hard work being an actor. No. <laughs> Okay, okay, okay. How does this feel? <laughs> it looks really good. Okay, okay. I'm scared of you. What is going on? Like no! <laughs> okay. So, what you're gonna do is you're gonna do a quick clip. Kendall, you're gonna try to scream and did the sweatiest twilight tour of our lives. <laughs> yep. That's what it feels like in South Carolina. I know. <laughs> See? It does get oh. hot here. Reels to come. So stunning. Let's go inside. Hello. Oh, we have oh. Kendall on the couch already. Love the couch. Elizabeth. <laughs> okay. Welcome to our bodacious B and B. <laughs> this is the living room. This is literally so chic and clean. And I mean, look at this. Adorable, it's so cute, I love it. This is an extra office space. The shelves, we love to see it. Obsessed with the leather couch. Just a cute little space. This bathroom is so cute and big. Oh my gosh. Have you ever seen these square toilets, Kendall? Me either. <laughs> it's so weird. But the shower is literally massive. I love it. The vanity space is perfect for multiple people. Love it. Also love this blue. And we have our cute little kitchen with the cute little cuties and the cute. <laughs> We're gonna make sure we're Short sure 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 board and our wine. Look at this cute kitchen though, it's so cute. So cute. Love it. We have the seating area. And we have Kendall. We have another bathroom down here. Just like a cute little one person. Another shower over here. Then go back through here. Go up the stairs. 
literally love this artwork. You go to the right and look at this adorable, are you kidding me? <laughs> the bed is over here. This closet is absolutely massive. So cute. Are you kidding me? There's a mirror there, which is also perfect. I don't really know what this space is supposed to be. It's just kind of a shelving storage little unit back here. But I love all the accessories in here. Also, this little window over here is going to be perfect for setting my camera. If we do a book haul or filming of any sort, literally perfect. We have the second bedroom that has the biggest beanbag chair I've ever seen in my life. That's just like a twin bed, but still so freaking cute. I love it. Then we have our third bedroom, which I think is like a twin or a queen. I just love the artwork and everything about this place. So adorable. Go back downstairs. Got him. And here's the outside. So cute, this little patio. Are you kidding me? There's a couple little chairs and a table. And then we just have the rest of the porch and some more chairs in the front of the house. So there is your little Airbnb tour. These two have never had a gooseberry. They just look like yellow tomatoes. And I don't like tomatoes. They're, it's like an interesting combo between like a tomato and a berry. Is it a tomato? I don't know. No, it's not. I, I don't know if Rachel will like it though. weird. Right? But I like it. It is like a tomato, but it's sweet. Yeah. It is like a tomato. Yeah. It doesn't taste like a berry. So you don't like it? I'm getting tomato. It tastes like a, a Dr. Seuss food. A I'm getting berries? tomato. Kendall's like, I ain't about that. What is it? Okay, it's rate it. Dr. Rate Seuss? it out of 10. <laughs> Did you say it's a Dr. Seuss thing? Um, it's a Dr. Seuss thing. I think. Food. <laughs> Dr. Seuss <food>. Two. <laughs> Two. Dang it. I'm sorry. I'm giving it a 7.5. No. Mm -hmm. You like the tomato you taste? I love tomatoes. Yeah, I do too. See what? Look at these compared to these. They're the same. These are fun. Yeah, they're different. It says tangy tropical. You know what they remind me of? Kumquats. Yes. But yep. smaller. Or bigger. AKA yeah. gooseberries. Interesting. Cheers. We all can have all. <laughs> Rachel's like, no, nope, I'm drink, taking I'll, the cheese. I'll eat all the berries. <laughs> what are we making? Charcuterie. I like how you said that in the video. <laughs> almost did, and then yeah. I was like, sure. Oh, you want to We've got quite the, the line of going. Yes. Yum. Okay. Yes, I'm on your See what you think Blueberry, of the berry goat cheese. Mm -hmm. Ooh, one of my faves. Mm. I'm gonna try it. You like it? Mm -hmm. Yeah. I'm gonna try it. Do you oh, like blueberries, so Rachel? Good. Oh my gosh. Yeah. I okay. Do. do you want to try it, Kendall? Does it taste like tomato? It's <laughs> no. Oh, that's so good. Oh my gosh. You like oh it? Oh my god. Great. Oh my god. Winner. Oh my goodness. It's like two, it's like a sharp but sweet. You should do it with a raspberry too. Oh. They have different fruits. That's a winner. Better yep. than That's the gooseberries. So good. <laughs> so good.
Good luck getting in here. <laughs> Olivia had to sit, like, basically <laughs> lean and roll. <laughs>
off that boot. Oh, it's cute. Oh, it's good. <laughs> <laughs> Look at this.
know that covers the whole block. Look at the part of her. Oh, this is the one I want. Oh, yeah. Mm hmm. Yep. I just realized. <laughs> Wait, I don't know why, but I'd almost be inspired to vlog it. Vlog, vlog it? Vlog, yeah. That'd be kind of funny. And I can vlog the real toilet. <laughs> We're getting hype. <laughs> the Barbie movie. Who <laughs> <laughs> knows? Where are we going? Barbie. Barbie. <laughs> 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 from Washington and in typical Olivia fashion. I didn't quite forget to film an outro or an intro for this video, but as soon as I got back, it's like a week later now, as soon as I got back, I got sick. I had family in town, my husband had family in town. I was trying to adjust to losing three hours because of the time change. And there's just been so much happening, but we are back home now. We are here and I am kind of sad. <laughs> I miss my friends. As you guys can probably tell, we had the best time of our lives and I would do it over and over again. I'm just gonna explain kind of who all three of these friends are. You guys probably already know Kendall. We hang out all the time. She's been in other videos. She lives here locally to me. Elizabeth though lives all the way in Washington State so that's why the three of us all flew out to see her and her baby Willa and her husband Michael who hosted us and they were so sweet for doing that. Literally the best hosts. But I have known who she is for a couple years now when she first joined the Gilmore Girls readathon. I think she dressed up like Luke, if I'm remembering correctly, and I literally will never forget that picture. I will not embarrass her by putting it in this video, but that's how I originally found out who she was. But Rachel, she owns Happy Go Lovely Sleeves. Some of you may have bought from her before, but she owns a book sleeve bookmark company that she runs out of her home. I don't know how she does it. She is a boss lady. I have known her since the beginning of Bookstagram. She's been watching my videos. I cannot explain to you like I feel like I've known them since high school And if we had known each other in high school and been college roommates I mean it would have just been utter chaos I'm sure you can tell from this video that we just have the best time But they truly feel like soul sisters people I can trust and I feel like it's kind of a weird scary thing to like go meet people or go fly out and meet people that you've never met before and spend an entire week with them but with God placing them in my life life it just makes so much more sense i wish i could describe to you in words how much these three mean to me but i feel like there is no words for it all i can say is that if you are hesitant or you have book friends you've never met before if there is a time or an opportunity that you have to go meet someone please do it it's absolutely life-changing and it's so much fun to be in a bookstore with each other and just hanging out and just doing those typical bookish or girlfriend things that 
that you don't typically get to do physically together. I feel like I wasn't so consumed with picking up my camera. I was very in the moment on this trip, which is probably why it looks very chaotic and kind of choppy, but I really just wanted to include basically everything I took just for memory's sake. The highlight was definitely going to the Twilight High School and Powell's. I mean, obviously it is an absolute bookish dream as a booktuber to go there. And I definitely did pick up some books. I think I picked up about eight different books there, which I am not going to be sharing in this video. I'm actually going to include them in a fall book haul, which I'm very excited for. But I did, of course, get a couple other merch things while I was there that I thought I would show you. The first is I have multiple of these postcards. This one is just Portland. This one is also just a Portland postcard, but I love the colors in this one. It's so fall. We have a Powell's card, which of course I love this art style and it's just so iconic. And then we just have a Powell's City of books, which I love the color scheme of this one as well. Of course, I had to get the iconic yellow and blue mug. I drink so much tea, so much coffee, especially hot coffee during the fall winter coming up. So I will be using this quite a bit. It just has a cute little umbrella. And then on this side, it just says Powell's Books, legendary independent bookstore. And of course, because I'm a graphic tea girl, I had the hardest time choosing if I wanted a sweatshirt, if I wanted a t-shirt, but I ended up settling on this heather kind of blue. It's not exactly navy. It's got some teal to it, but it just says Powell City of Books with this blue and it's just a normal short sleeve shirt, but I'm absolutely in love and I'm going to be wearing this all the time. I also absolutely love collecting the Starbucks Been There mugs, so I had to get the one for Washington, but there's just a bunch of fun things like Bigfoot on there and just, uh, I love this so much. I love the green. It's definitely super fall and the inside is just this nice deep green. Kind Sweet Elizabeth gave us each a bag that has to do with a March sister from Little women and depending on our personality she kind of picked a bag for us and she thought I was the most like Joe March. She got these from the common room shop. If you guys have never shopped there you need to check her stuff out but it's just the anatomy of Joe March and there's all these fun different things. There's Taylor Swift quotes on here and it was just super fun being able to use these while we bookshop together. They're really durable and I love a good bookish tote. So Elizabeth, you are so sweet. She also got us each a page petal bookmark, which I am obsessed with their bookmarks. If you guys have never seen them, they're all dried flowers, but each of us got our book boyfriends on here. Of course, mine is Dr. Jacob Maddox from Yours Truly by Abby Hamed. Is. I absolutely adore and love him so much and the cover is red, the book cover, so that's why the flowers are red. Another fun thing that we all did is we made like Taylor Swift friendship bracelets, but we also made like these diamond painting friendship bookmarks. So we all have similar ones, but if you guys haven't tried diamond painting before, Rachel had never tried it and now she's obsessed. So if you guys haven't tried diamond painting before, these were just really cheap on Amazon. So yeah, there you have it. Those are all the other little things that I brought home with me. There's a couple other things that Elizabeth gifted us, but the those are the fun bookish things I thought I would share. Of course, I'm going to be sharing the books that I came home with. And I think I had about 25-ish. We all kind of did like a little bit of a book swap and picked a book out for each other and bought it. And so that was really fun. But I think that is it, you guys. I hope you enjoyed this very chaotic but very fun vlog. I'm so blessed to have these three in my life. Like I said, if you guys ever get the opportunity just to meet up with someone, it does not have to be a crazy week-long trip but I highly recommend it. Thank you so much for watching and supporting my channel and I will see you in my next video.